Right then, another video. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in the world. Um, when people are updating their graphics drivers, I think most people are doing it the wrong way. So if you come in, see, as if you're using uh, GeForce Experience, I just find it a lot easier to do all my driver downloads and whatnot. But if you are using this, there's a, a proper way of downloading your drivers and getting them installed correctly. So if you come into here, you click on your drivers tab. If you click here, it'll ask you, it'll say do you want game ready driver or studio driver. The game ready one, I've already got the latest one. I've only just seen this for myself, so I came to studio driver. Let that download, don't ever click express installation. Because what that does is you'll download your drivers and it'll install drivers on top of older drivers so the PC is getting confused as to which driver it needs to be able to run the software correctly so if you come into custom installation let it do its thing I'll, I'll speed this up or I'll just cut it so you guys don't have to uh, watch all this oh there we go actually so we click yes so it's preparing to install NVIDIA Studio Driver. I've never actually used this, so I'm keen to see what it's all about. You know what, let's just run through it. How about a joke of the day? I can't say joke of the day because I don't update, I don't do videos daily. Joke of the month, really. What do you call an American B? A USB? <laughs> well, yeah, whatever. So this will come up now with the different components: You've got your graphics driver, physics system software, HD audio driver, USB C driver, with all the latest versions and the current versions and whatnot. I'm gonna come down here and tick this box: perform a clean installation. What that will do: delete all of your graphics drivers. Anything here, it will delete and replace with brand new ones so you're not piling drivers on top of another one if that makes sense we come down here click install might lose a bit of the video my screen might go off just how we get on so yeah uh, my screen did go off but uh, if we go back into GeForce experience as that video ended I realized if you install this studio driver it'll only install this one and it'll get rid of this one so you just you just choose which one you want obviously I think it's best to have this uh, game ready driver I'm on the latest version release 15th of the 4th 2020 but yeah all you want to do is make sure you do custom installation never do express because it'll just override other drivers and keep stacking them on the top of older ones so um, I hope this video helps you getting your drivers up and running and I'll see you in the next video. Peace, boys.